I got my eyes set on you. Da 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 da. Set on you. Da 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 da. Set on you. Da 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 da. Set on you. It's not the bottom money. After close to 28 long years of knowing him, it makes me feel extremely honoured and proud to see him get married and also for me to have the chance to be his best man because finally for once, he's saying that I am the best. <laughs> <laughs> now, I only say that because growing up, it was actually Tim that was always the best in everything, apart from FIFA. He might have his own opinions about that, but that's for another time. It really meant a lot to me that, despite how different the places we were at that point of time, that he still really valued our friendship and believed in me. And I'm really glad it all eventually paid off, because if it wasn't for Tim, I would definitely not be where I am today. So, Tim, from the bottom of my heart, thank you for being such a constant positive influence in my life as I am sure you are to everyone else as well. I have known Timothy Ma since, uh, believe it or not, he was bigger and taller than me uh, in Catholic high school. Uh, since those days, I have watched him grow from just a boy in a Man U jersey to a mature, accomplished, confident man who is still, unfortunately, sometimes wearing a Man U jersey. Timothy Ma is loyal to his friends in a way that makes other people like me want to be just as loyal to him in a way that wants that makes us want to take friendship very seriously in a way that makes us realize that we are becoming better versions of ourselves by being his friend when tim and steph started going out the first clue that i had that this was going to be really serious was through tim's evolving relationship with christianity and with god actually this was when i realized how deeply steph places God at the center of her life. It was through the way that I saw Tim deliberately and slowly open himself up to a new faith. Think about how difficult it is in your early 20s, in your mid-20s, to completely change the way you think about the nature and purpose of this world. To totally embrace a belief system that you didn't already have. This is hard, hard work. And when I saw Tim do this over the years, I could see that it was the love between him and Steph that was guiding him and pulling him through. Steph hits beats precisely, but this is important. Not all the beats, just the ones that matter. This is how I like to think of her as a person as well. And just like the music she dances to, the song at the foundation of Steph's life must have a deep meaning. When I saw Tim and Steph last Sunday, she saw that I had a crack in my phone, the same phone that I'm pretending not to read off right now. And the first thing she did is take the cover off her own phone and give it to put on mine. I have it on right now. And then she said, Hey, Saturday, I bring for you screen protector. This woman really said that on the day of her own wedding, she was going to bring a screen protector for someone like me. And if I... If I, someone who has hardly been in Singapore for the last seven years, if, if even I can be a recipient of this and so much more of Steph's grace and kindness, then what more wonderful things are in store for my friend Tim, who I know feels more blessed than he can put into words to have Steph as his wife. Me, this is the day you become a wife. It's pretty surreal. Because it, was, it just seems like yesterday when three of us Three kids were spending our afternoons after school attempting to finish our homework, watching Totally Spies, Kim Possible. 
Anyway, there is really nothing to be said about. I'm actually feeling very excited for you because you are going to be starting a new chapter of your life. I'm honoured to be standing here to congratulate you on your wedding day. I hope you know that Ben and I will always be there for you. To Timo, Timo, <laughs> thank you for making my sister so happy. After hearing what the groomsman can ha has said about you, I'm actually very comforted. Yeah, it's really great comfort knowing that she has a man who is caring, loving, and supportive by her side. Please look after my sister and trust me when I tell you she's usually right, okay? <laughs> Stephanie, marriage is the union of one man and one woman voluntarily entered into for life and to the exclusion of all others. <laughs> but you go first. Yes. <clears throat> okay. I, Timothy, take you, Stephanie, as my wedded wife and promise before God and these witnesses to have and to hold from this day forward <clears throat> for seeking all others for better or for worse for richer or for poorer in sickness and in health to love and to cherish until death do us part according to God's holy ordinance there too I pledge my love for you Yeah, without COVID, it had, would have been 400. Oh, oh my goodness. <laughs> yeah. I'm so I wanted something really light and can run around with. <laughs> <laughs> so this came about... Because you learned from your wedding. Because yes, my sister's wedding one was huge. And I was like, okay, I'm gonna find something that I can run. <laughs> Super simple gowns. Yeah, that's the way to go. Oh. Hello, Dad. <laughs> you look so beautiful. <laughs> yeah. Are you excited? Yes, of course. <laughs> okay. Okay. This is ceremony. Okay, don't pull. Don't pull. <laughs> my, head, my head will go. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Now that you are going to the next phase of life, Mommy and Daddy wish you all the best. Okay? But Mommy's good for you. Yeah. Okay, come. Dilla, okay. I just want to thank you. Thank you for this special day for Stephanie. I mean, as she journey on in her next phase of life, love, please continue to bless her, give her happiness and joy, and guide her as she go along as a wife of Timothy. Lord, I thank you for her and I pray for this in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Okay, Mommy, you can go. Hello. Okay, we need to impress her. Come. It's all easy. 
Is it be, beyond here? Is on my own already. Yeah. Okay, ready? Okay. We, we now. Okay. <laughs> you ready? When you dance and laugh tonight, it is where we are in this habitat with long company. You'll be in my arms. Yeah. Hello. Hello. Yeah. Okay. Oh, is it? Is it supposed to be funny? I thought it's not. Funny. Okay. Yeah. Congratulations. Thank you. Congratulations. Oh yeah, mum and dad. How was it? How was the morning? Good, good dancing. Oh, is it? Oh, you saw, you saw the, you saw the dancing. Oh, is it? You face time. You saw the whole thing. Yeah. Not bad, right? Not bad. Wow, <laughs> 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 Okay, okay. 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 Okay,
do, I do, I do, I do. I do, I do, I do. And I plant a garden in the summertime. Thank you everyone for attending Steph and my wedding. I hope everyone is having a good time drinking and talking. Uh, it is slightly unfortunate that we are faced with COVID restrictions and constraints during dinner. But amidst all this, Steph and I are glad that everyone is here, present with us. Thank you, groomsmen. Yeah, uh, not sure if you guys remember this tomorrow, but okay. Let me go down the list, okay? Firstly, thanks to my best man, Gopi, for flying back from UK for this wedding. And to help out so much, uh, having known you for 28 years of my life, we have really seen each other grow from uh, scrubbing each other's back uh, in the toilet <laughs> when we were small, uh, bathing together, uh, to just chilling, playing soccer, you know, drinking together. Uh, Steph, for flying back from US, appreciate how much uh, you really understand me sometimes. Uh, going through OCS together and the many conversations we had together is really memorable. Uh, uh, looking forward to more of it together. Yeah. Uh, Tun and Liu, yeah. meeting you guys in 5B and classmates to SEC4. Uh, we have really seen each other uh, grow during this awkward, the awkward stage to what we are now. And uh, thanks for being the naughty people. So much that the teachers think I'm an angel. Yeah, it's, it's a contrast yeah, that, that really made me an angel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you guys did better. Yeah, congrats. <laughs> okay, and thanks for being so, um, yeah, and thanks, for Matt, for being so sensitive and caring. The aesthetic guy who is always so chill and most of the time always getting bullied by the whole group. Yeah, just because you're so chill. And uh, Drew, the MC, and uh, Jared, the, the DJ, yeah for being the, the most handsome and cool guys in EMP. Sorry, sorry for the rest, yeah. And supportive friends, uh, really appreciate the two of you um, for being there for this wedding, yeah. SK, SK, I think you are really gone. <laughs> you are really gone, okay, but... <laughs> you're really gone. <laughs> uh, thanks, thanks for recording so that tomorrow he can, he can listen, yeah. Thanks for the many rides home together, yeah. Uh, love the talks and bickering we had over 10 years. Uh, funny how we bickered so much that my mom thought both of us were together. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, and uh, Josh, uh, thanks for being the most ridiculous person I know. Even though you're a walking meme, I know you always got my back. Yeah. Keith, thanks for being, thanks for being the most uh, reliable friend I have. Uh, comforting to know there's this uh, guy I can always talk to when I need it. Yeah, so uh, really appreciate your help today also. Yeah. Uh, thanks to the Ace again. Yeah, uh, JC was a blast with you guys and I'm glad we lasted through Army Uni and uh, now working days. Uh, to the Ace girls, uh, you guys are the fanciful bunch with a, with a lot of ideas, outing ideas that I never know, uh, that I will never know without you guys. Yeah, including my hands night. Yeah. Yes. Uh, to CG, CG, yeah, thank you for the many memories, Bible studies we had together. You guys have been a big part of, uh, not you, Gideon, nah, kidding. <laughs> uh, you guys have been a big part of uh, Steph and my journey. And also to other Calvarians, uh, your presence here means a lot to us. We are glad that this community has kept, kept us grounded in God's Word. Thank you. Yeah. Uh, to my family, uh, CSA Waipo, Waipo. <笑>外婆外婆很像不再听外婆谢谢外婆呃从我出生以后一直为我很多好吃的食物虽然我们不住在一起可是每一次见到你都可以感觉到你很疼爱我和Steph我和Steph结婚后会经常去你家找你吃
Every time I see you, I just want to smell and sayang you. Thank you, Papa and Mommy. Being the youngest in the family, I had the privilege of being spoiled by you guys. Thanks for giving me such a wonderful childhood. I had so much love and attention from you guys. Although you guys are not the most expressive in terms of showing your love. Mommy, thanks for being the superwoman you are. Even though you're always busy at work, I've never felt neglected. Growing up, you'll come back at 8, 9 p.m., but still play with us, accompany us to sleep, and then carry on with our work or housework. All this love you gave, although I don't say it out much, but deep down I feel very loved, and I can never ask for a better mother. To Papa, thanks for being the fun dad who is always there. Yeah, my friends sometimes say that you are the cooler person, cooler than me. Yeah, always, yeah, always tell, yeah. <laughs> it's true, it's true, yeah. Don't, don't say that so loud, yeah, please. <laughs> Uh, you have always been there for the family silently at the back. You have taught me the importance of being there for the family and taught me many life lessons while growing up. To my new mom and dad, thanks for being so understanding and caring since the first time we met. Enjoyed the many meals, celebrations and conversations we had. I promise I'll take care of Steph to love her and to protect her as much as I can. To Mel and Ben, thanks for making me feel like a part of the family since the start. You guys are a fun bunch and I love and I look forward to meet to, to more meetups and hanging out at Red Hill Lane. Yeah, sorry. Yeah. To Steph, uh, it was a cheese fries that started our whole journey. And this journey has made me a better person. We have gone through many milestones together. And I'm glad we have always stood by each other through it all. We are about to face many laughters, smiles, tears, disagreements together. But I know we will continue to love and to sharpen each other through it all and make Christ the center of it. I love you, and let's start this chapter together, and until death, do us part. Um, I think I've been doing quite well. Um, do not have the crying vibes, um, because I think just standing here, seeing everybody, I feel happy to go on. Uh, I mean, not, not that. I don't want to go on, but, but like happy to move on to the next stage of life because I feel like nothing really will change and it's just like adding more to the presence. Okay, uh, thank you family and friends for joining us on this special occasion, uh, being fancy and dressed up. Um, if you know me, this is a rare occasion. I'd much rather be in t-shirt and shorts, uh, eating at Old Airport Road. But your presence outweighs what uh, I'd rather do. Uh, and this is nice too, having most of our loved ones here. First, I'll start with my mom and my dad. Um, I know bringing me up was not easy. Uh, dancing, tuition, holidays were all like big ticket items, but yet both of you never held back and always wanted to give me the best experiences. Uh, mom, thanks for sacrificing so much for me, even when you are busy with your own things. You try to cook for us and make time for us. Um, you keep the house in such a pristine and pretty state. Um, I, I appreciate all that you do, even though sometimes I look and feel too stoic. Uh, sorry to add to your schedule, but I think I will still be back for dinner. Um, Dad, thanks for all the conversations we have in the car and outside of it. You have taught me so much about life since young. Um, all these things you have, thought, you have taught and exemplified, I will remember and keep it in my heart for the many, many years to come. You are really the, the most patient man on earth, and you really set the standard high. Uh, Mom and Dad, you have indeed shown me many great examples of how to be great parents. Um, I thank God for all the time that you both have made for me, supporting me in my adventures and bringing me on adventures. So here's to more in the future when travel opens again. Yay! <laughs> to my siblings, Ben and Zeh, um, we really have uh, too many ridiculous times together, but every moment was always so enjoyable. Adding a Tia Hao and a, and a Tim made the dynamics even crazier, but I love it. Um, I'm so certain that we will always have each other's back. Um, thank you for being siblings whom I can always talk to, laugh with, and do things the world shall never know about. Um, we fought so much when we were younger. And I think we fought so much that we no longer have any more quarrelling fuel, which is great. Uh, thank you for being my best friends. Uh, thanks, Jeff, for allowing me to crash at your house whenever um, I want and helping me to settle the parts of the wedding which I am not very interested to think about. And also allowing me to take your things whenever I want. 
today, um, after today, I am very proud to say that I'm going to have three houses to crash at. Tia Hao, thanks for also being a gener so generous towards me since the day you met me. Thanks for uh, giving Tim and I a lot of auntie advice uh, on good deals. But uh, please direct your finance-related advice to Tim. Thank you. Uh, Benny, I am very thankful that you came back last year and that we could spend so much time together eating supper, watching movies and doing a lot of YOLO things and also a, deep, a lot of our deep conversations about life and God. I will miss uh, watching Korean dramas with you. Um, and also, I think number one would be randomly running into your room to just be stupid. But don't worry, I'll be back with a Tim who will totally FOMO when we are playing without him. <laughs> to my new mom and dad, thank you for doing so much um, to prepare for my arrival into your house. Thank you for selflessly giving up your place so to ensure that Tim and I will be comfortable. Uh, since meeting you, I have eaten more cakes. I mean, not just you, I mean the whole family. I've eaten way more cakes and ice creams, ate more suppers, uh, and got to know and taste so many more fruits. Uh, thank you for welcoming me and loving me since day one. I am blessed to have known you. Uh, Mum, the business card that you gave me during our first meeting is still in my drawer. It will be a memory I will forever remember. Dad, thank you for uh, doing so much for me to, uh, to make me feel at home. Uh, Gwen and Eugene, you both are amazing siblings to have. Um, thank you for all those times we sat downstairs after dinner and we would just talk and share our lives. Uh, I have learned to appreciate just hanging around after dinner, to chat and even to just do our own things in the presence of one another. I think the way I see all of you shower love towards my family, even the new Noel, um, is very evident of the generosity that all of you embody. To my extended family here, uh, I won't be going missing. I will be back for Sunday dinner uh, with Tim. Hopefully, uh, no. Hopefully, he will be there. Um, we, you have watched uh, all of us grow up, the cousins and uh, and myself. And thank you to all of you for um, the fun times that um, you all create and plan, so that the cousins can play together with us and we can grow up together, having such great memories. Um, it was a joy, really, having um, cousins to grow up with, uh, and till today, still talking and spending time together. Yeah, it is my hope that our relationship will all continue to deepen over the years and our dinners will still go on. To my new family, other new family, the AMP. My friends ask me what AMP stands for. Um, yeah, it stands for uh, Ang Mo Pai. <laughs> yeah, okay, never mind. Story for another day. We had a good first meeting in Melbourne. Uh, I remember the K barbecue that we had, if you do. And uh, many times Liu was trying to be offensive towards my degree and my name. No lucky like kidding. kidding. <laughs> um, you guys gave me uh, family vibes, very inclusive, very welcoming, and I see that till today. Um, pity we didn't have any pictures of that day. Um, your friendships really never ceases to um, amaze me. I always asked him how you guys can meet every single week and not get tired of each other. But after being part of the friendship, I can see why. The way you guys share about your lives is very unfiltered. And um, you are all each other's first point of contact and always got each other's back. I am very honoured to be part of this friendship. Thank you for having me and I guess you are stuck with me too. <laughs> to, my sec oh, <laughs> to my secondary school friends, Ranita, uh, Julia, Nick, Joyce, uh, Sal and Shah especially, um, we really truly embody multiracialism. How this group came about was very random, almost like picking a candy in a candy store and then putting everything together and just like checking it out. Yeah, thank you for growing up with me. I hold important memories with each of you. Even when everyone was in different parts of the world, we always enjoyed those Skype calls to catch up. I love it how our outings are actually just eating and talking at someone's place. Um, and I also love that you guys have amazing, baking, amazing cooking and baking skills. Please continue to spoil me. I think also probably need to spoil Cell uh, with more of it. I will bring the fruits and Cell with his, her 500 grams of cheese. <laughs> Thank you for supporting me throughout this wedding planning. Uh, and being so willing to be involved, I appreciate you guys very much. 
So, SLC was really a turning point for us. I'm very thankful that it happened because out of the trauma came a friendship and memories that we can talk and laugh about till today. Yeah. <laughs> you are always a confident person and I love that about you. Ignoring the world and what they say and doing what is you. Uh, while knowing that your security is in your creator. Joycey, you have the biggest of hearts and um, have both a gentle and angsty side of you. Your laughter is always so contagious and you are always so encouraging in your words and actions towards me. I am glad that SLC itself also changed our friendship and that uh, we could always go to each other to complain and grumble about things. Ranita, I am glad that you have enjoyed going on a trip with Tim and I. And even though the toilets weren't clean and it was very physically demanding, we loved every moment with you. Thank you for listening to my grumbles, especially in secondary school, and having so much fun together since we met in Sec 1. I appreciate our HTHT sessions and sharing about our lives with no judgment at all. And even if there was, um, it will be placed outright on the table and humbly accepted. Sha, I don't remember, I really don't remember us going to Swenson's and spending $50 on food. That's a lot of money for a 17 year old, yeah? But I do remember finding a lot of comfort in our friendship during that period of our life. Um, life would have been very different if I stayed on in ACSI, but I might not be where, I, where we are without this separation. Thank you for being the stable one in this group. I appreciate all the open conversations we can have. Jilly, we have too many ridiculous times together. Uh, I apologize uh, for the agony I gave you when I kept from you who I was dating five years ago. Um, you, are, you are one who is always very present with people around you and make those around you feel like they matter. I love and have learned that from you. Please continue to be the very capo one in the group. <laughs> Nick, we totally started our friendship on the wrong page in P3, but in a short while, we were once again good friends. I'm very thankful for you and for the many HGHG sessions we have with topics changing constantly as we grew. Thank you for always being there for me. Um, I'm very glad that our schools were just across the road so that we could always meet. Iris, um, you are very precious to me. You have encouraged me so, so much over the years and have walked through life with me during the hard times and the happy times and all this while constantly reminding me um, to have my eyes fixed on Christ. Thank you for being such an anchor in my life. It was an honour to be under your faculty in Hua Chong. And it's still an honour to be led uh, by you in the CG. You have no idea how much I'm going to miss you when you leave to a faraway land. To Kat, Kat and Adelia, you both have made my studying so much more fun and enjoyable when you were in secondary school. Delia, you were my first friend in SEGS, my first table partner. When we, went, when we just came in and we literally walked through so many milestones together. Um, after my family, I think you are really next in line to have gone through so many milestones with me. Kat, you have been also a friend that I deeply treasure. The HTHTs we have, the endless fun that we can have after and in fact even during tuition. Um, it's very crazy how both of you are way ahead of me um, in life while I just got married. Um, but I really look forward to life together with you both and your family in the many years to come. Xingyuan, what can I say to you? I think I have told you many times before, meeting you in Sengwan was just a preparation of a deepening of friendship in JC and a securing of the friendship that we have. Thank you for being a friend that I can always go to no matter what. Thank you for standing by my side all these years and being a great listening ear we have always, that you have always been. Uh, you are a very precious friend that I love very deeply. Jia Hui, you are another gem in my life. Seeing how God has divinely placed you in my life through dance and allowing us to walk through life together, I am very thankful. Your gentleness and your tight hugs always make me feel so loved and treasured. Thank you. I really thank God for placing us in the same dance school and somehow bringing us together. Jeremy, hi. <laughs> Uh, thank you for lending, lending me so many things for this wedding. <laughs> Being my fashion advisor and sharing yours and Mitchell's experiences uh, to me so openly. 
Thank you for walking with me way before Tim appeared in my life. Um, thanks, uh, Mitchell and Germs. Thanks for including Tim and I in your life. Please bring us on more walks and let us know of your secret hiding spots around Singapore. Um, and also, I think I want to specially thank Ne. Uh, I think Tim and I are filled with a lot of uh, gratitude and thanksgiving. We receive your well wishes very well. <laughs> Um, you and Gideon were o we are like almost my second and third bro younger brothers that I have. Um, now you are a very precious friend, uh, very generous, very caring, and you are you are really one of a kind. I am very thankful to have met you through the mission trip. And USA last, if we have gone to USA last year, it would have been very crazy. But God always has His purposes, and this amazing video came out of it. So from the bottom of my heart, I am very thankful for you. And the video, everybody was by Nehemiah behind there. Uh, just Tim and God left. Okay, Timo, thank you for thank you for you. Thank, thank thankful for you. <laughs> thankful for all the open conversations and silent fights that we have. You, it has taught me to humble myself, look beyond my personal needs, and forgive always. Your patience with me, your determination in what you do, your love for people have inspired me and this I have learned from you through the years. During this whole wedding prep, thank you for following me for all my gown visits and doing things together. I know the journey ahead will not be smooth sailing at all and that life is not a bit of roses with rainbows and unicorns. Um, and I know that we will have many challenges ahead of us. But I am so certain that with Christ in the vessel, we can definitely smile at the storm. I look forward to moving to the next, to moving our relationship to the next stage, committed to each other and first and foremost to God. Most importantly, I our praise and honor and glory belongs to God alone. Uh, I thank God for His endless love and mercy and grace. I thank God for gifting me all these precious friendships that you all are here. I thank God for giving me a husband who can who I can show my weaknesses to because we know that the perfect version of me is still a work in progress and will constantly be till the day he returns. Thank you for blessing us with your love um, and your friendship. And we are truly nothing without God's divine hand placing all of you purposefully in our lives. I have ended. Thank you, everybody. <laughs> Look at my group stand and say, hey, dance, just dance. <laughs> just dance. Then you'll dance ready. Okay, very, very easy. Yeah. Okay? Yeah. Ready? Yeah? Get ready to dance at your table. Activate all of them. Again, welcome Mr. and Mrs. Timothy Ma. I do, I do, I do, I do. I do, I do, I do. I do. 